Hi guys, in today's video we're going to be talking about what has got to be one of my favourite miniatures games workshops are produced in a very long time, which is Angron, the demon primarch of the World Eaters. And I had such a fun time painting this miniature, guys. I really did. Uh, the reason for that is I actually apply, uh, applied a new technique that's sweeping our hobby at the moment called Slap Chop. Uh, for those that are not aware of the slap chop technique, sounds so funny saying that, um, uh, that are not aware of the slap chop technique, it uh, involves priming your miniature in a black uh, primer base, then you get hold of a dry brush and you literally work up from dark greys all the way up to white, uh, through the um, dry brushing stages to get like a, a pre-highlighted miniature then you come in with uh, speed paints uh, by the army painter and they uh, go over absolutely beautifully over the miniature and once they're laid down what happens is all that pre-highlighting you did in the dry brushing stage over the black primer uh, shows up all those highlights and shadows and gives you know an amazing result now i um have uh, been contacted or i got in contact with adam i should say from the army painter and i said you know how impressed i am uh with the slap chop technique and how well i, I believe the uh, speed paints work uh, for that technique and uh, he said, would you like to do a, a tutorial on an, an Angron on your YouTube channel and we'll send you the new Speed Paints 2.0, which I haven't used yet. I've been using the original Speed Paints. And I jumped up the opportunity for two reasons. One, I can't wait to try Speed Paints 2.0. Uh, but, but even more so, I need to upload a tutorial on this channel where I have so many comments from people saying, when are we going to see um, a tutorial uploaded on your channel? And uh, we're going to do that very soon. Hopefully within the next two weeks or even sooner than that. And we're going to uh, do the slap chop technique. And we're going to get the end result looking just like this. Uh, uh, another thing uh, is that I had so much positive feedback on my social medias recently about uh, Angron and the way I painted him. And I, I just want to say a huge thank you for everyone that's left a, a, a comment uh, and a like on, on my social medias about Angron. And uh, yeah, it's uh, great. Um, uh, for those all, uh, asking how I... Uh, painted the golds now the golds again involved using speed paints so i use regular uh, gold acrylic paints and then um i did an all over wash of the army painters crusader skin and i think the crusader skin uh crusader skin i should say speed paint worked way better than traditional um uh, washes if you like so you know you're a you know you traditional um null niles or your agrax earth shades or your army painters um dark tone and and etc etc uh, the speed paint in my opinion just gives such a beautiful result over metallics but anyway uh just just want to say a huge thank you once again to all the positive uh outpouring and yes we will be seeing a painting tutorial on how to get this exact same result on an angron very soon so thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch this video and i'll catch you in the next one 